Well, let's take a brief look at GardenCAD. You start the program by clicking on the Start button, let your mouse hover over all programs, go to this GardenCAD folder and click GardenCAD. The program will run, you can maximise your view and all of the tools that you expect in a computer-aided design program are here. One can click on the Draw, click Line, draw a line in the usual way and we can make those lines of defined length. I could put an arc in like so. A three-point arc has now gone in. I could right-click and zoom a window around an area like that. But I'm sure you're interested in looking at a garden design. File and open. When you install the program, you get a series of sample files. Let's open one called First Garden, and here we are looking at it. If I use the wheel of the mouse and roll it away from me, I get a zoom tool. If I hold the wheel down and drag, I can pan. If I right click, left click on zoom extents, and I can see the whole design. If I were to roll in on this area here and I wanted to place some more species in there, I would simply go planting and select some sort of symbol and specify a base point and a point of movement. You can see it's come in here, a base point there, pop it in there, I'll roll in on it, we click it, we right click, we can scale it by just dragging like so, so let's make it a big one. Once we've got a big one in, we can well, we'll hit the escape key, let's hit this one, right click, we can copy it, mark a point on there and we can stamp multiple copies of that in there, right click to finish, right click, zoom extents. So can you see you can very rapidly build up your garden design and do it in an intuitive way. Everything either works with the right mouse button for your properties and options and so on, but when an entity is selected, such as that one there, a right click gives you the ability to mirror, explode, uh, erase, I can erase that one, uh, it's gone, and uh, deal with things in that way. So hopefully get, that gives you a quick overview of GardenCAD. We'll put lots more movies to show you how to do specialised things in this environment, but it's designed to be a simple, easy to use tool.